It's absurd to say people today are smarter or better than the days past. It's very likely modern-day individuals know less. Today consists not of using the brain but feelings, mostly. Just because technology is better doesn't mean we're smarter. We are living off the ingenuity of the past. We don't live in fear of beasts of prey, other than politicians. But various goods and services were designed to solve a specific problem. The free individual has the right to be immoral. This in no way implies he has the right to be unethical. Those two are very different. There is a fear that another may know more than you. This causes many to try to stand on moral ground. This is based on the confusion that morals and ethics are synonyms. It's incomprehensible to the so-called moralist that he supports violence. Feelings have gotten in the way. Let us not be deceived by confusing morals with ethics. The clear thinkers are considered the evil one. In fact, the opposite is true. You are fed intellectual poison. Those clear thinkers are providing you with the antidote. They might be considered as dangerous. However, they are providing a valuable service. Rather than be viewed as the evil ones, they should be viewed as benefactors of mankind. There is a clear link between the modern-day man and the sad state of education. The free thinker may discuss things that are considered forbidden. Discussing something doesn't mean that person agrees with what was said. Hurt feelings can put an end to a discussion. It's about finding the truth, not tiptoeing through life trying not to offend people. Discussing something isn't a direct threat of violence. The so-called primitive man may have been smarter than the modern-day man. Labeling something as primitive, barbarous, or any other term doesn't put an end to the discussion. People might understand that these aren't cower arguments as education wasn't so awful. It's not uncommon to have these so-called evil men to be recognized great men later. Modern man hides himself in society.